the rule number one says that assign as much possible to the cell with the smallest unit cost in the entire table so in this one how much we can allocate maximum 200 so allocate 200 if this allocate 200 it is cancel out this one is 100 so this time strike out the column no rule that you should go by row or you should go by column now don't consider this cell now what is the next one is 4 cost so 4 you can allocate here and 4 you can allocate here also so if you allocate this if you select this 4 then how much you can supply 100 cancel out this how much is left here 100 therefore cancel strike out the this one what is the next one is again 4 so how much we can allocate 100 and this one is cancel out so this time this one is strike out by itself these two and what is the cost here is 5 but we can't allocate here can we allocate at 5 no because there is no capacity so can we allocate 300 how many allocations are 1 2 3 4 this one is m plus n minus 1 m m is 3 n is also 3 minus 1 this number is 5 but how many allocation cells 1 2 3 4 so allocation cells are 4 so this is not a initial basic feasible solution this is not equal to this so this is not initial basic feasible solution 100 into 4 is the cost is the cost 200 into 3 to 9 is 4000 100 the same problem we have solved initially at this stage first involved is 3900 is the 3900 is the lower cost as compared to list cost method equals to what 4100 so actually this solution is not accepted why it is not accepted because we are not satisfied m plus n minus 1 equal to number of occupancies now in this problem the list cost is one one here and one here sorry this is 40 so i will allocate 40 if you want if you wish you can allocate 10 year also so this is exhausted this one is left 30 so cancel out column first now this time we have demand equals to what 110 50 50 can we allocate 50 so we'll allocate 50 so this is cancel out this left is 60 so cancel out the first row and don't uh, calculate the underneath the cell but you can very well use these cells now from this unoccupied cell the list cost is 2 so we want 60 90 is available can we fulfill the requirement so this one is 60 so this is left 30 so cancel out the column 3 also because this is exhausted now this one is star and what do you want 30 so let give 30 if you give 30 it will cancel out so that row is strike off this is 30 so this will also strike off 30 plus 30 60 that is the look so we have m equal to 3 n equal to 3 minus 1 is 5 is same as number of occupied cell what is the cost 40 into 1 the total cost involved is 510. This one is the difference between the two list value in the column or the row. If these are equal, then penalty will be 0. So, here the first of all we will go by row wise. The lowest cost is 3, and the next immediate cost is 4. So, difference between 4 and 3 is 1. In the second row, the lowest cost is 5. The next immediate cost is 7. So 7 minus 5. So that equals to 2. In the third row, the lowest cost is 4. Next immediate is 5. So difference is 1. Proceed in the same fashion along column. The lowest cost is 4 and this cost is also 4. So this is 0. This one is 3 and this one is 5 difference is 2 in this case 5 is the lowest 
and 8 is the next so this one is 3 so in this fashion collect the penalty in for row and column the maximum penalty in this one that equal to 3 so in this column search cost allocate maximum either of demand or either of supply so allocate maximum and ready for next penalty so go for again this number is lowest cost is 3 next object number is 4 so penalty is 1 and 5 next number is 2 7 so penalty is 2 don't calculate this this one is 3 so what is the maximum penalty is it 3 so look into this column which one is minimum cost 4 out of 200 and 300 can we allocate 200 how much is left 100 take out column 1 this is 3 and this one is 8 3 and 8 so penalty is 5 this one is 5 and this one is 9 so penalty is 4 no allocation here no allocation here this one is 5 and 3 so this one is 2 this one is 8 and 9 so this one is 1 so which is the maximum penalty 5 so you have to go to row side so 3 and 8 so minimum cost is 3 can we allocate maximum 200 or can we allocate 100 only we can only allocate 100 and this value is left with 100 but because of this one we have to strike the column sorry row 1 this we have to go by only two cells are left okay so there is no question of penalty now so what we do now now check 5 and check 9 which one is low cost 5 only two cells are left so don't do the penalty job so this is 5 can we go for 100 so 100 is 200 is recorded here so this one is 200 if you are left with two cells don't do the penalty so how many steps of penalty required three step for this problem but in next time you may require more also check occupancy one two three four five guaranteed five is it plus n minus one five so this is the initial basic principle solution what is the cost 200 into 4 100 into 3 100 into 5 200 into 9 and 100 into 5 so cost is check total supply total supply is 700 950 so this one is 950 this value so is it a balanced transportation problem yes, sir. so this problem we are going to solve by penalty method that is by van so in this row this cost is 11 and next immediate cost is 30 so 13 minus 11 will be penalty equal to 2 is it 4 this is 10 this is 14 this one is this one is 10 next is 13 3 this side 5 this is 13 and 18 huh? this one is 1 this one is 0 highest penalty is in column is 5 now in this column if you see the minimum cost is what 11 and if you see this column the minimum cost is what 13 so out of 11 and 13 which one is minimum cost? 11. So we will select 11. What is the requirement? 200. What is the production? 250. So can we meet the requirement? So let allocate. So this is cancel out. How much is left? 50. If your column is finished. Now what is the penalty? This one is 30 and 14 is 1. This one is 18, 14, 10 is 4. 24, 13 and 10. 10 and 13, 3. Don't calculate for this. 13 and 18, 5. This one is 1. 10 and 10 is 0. So maximum penalty is 5. Minimum cost is 13. How much allocation possible? 50. How much left? 175. Can we strike out the row? Next penalty. 18, 14, 10. 10 and 14. 4. 
Minimum cost is requirement is 175. Available quantity 300. So can we give all 175? So left is 125. So this time is the column is cancel out. So this one is 14 and 10 is 4. 13 and 10 3. This one is 14 and 13 1. 10 and 10. 0. Maximum is 14. That is 34. Minimum cost is 10. How much available? 125. What is the requirement? 250. But can we give 125? We can. So how much is left? 125 left. Now this 125 is cancelled out. So you have to strike off road to left minimum cost is 10 available 125 cancel out 275 275 cancel out 275 that finish the problem now check the solution is feasible or not for this purpose we have to check number of rows plus column minus 1 equal to what 6 how many allocations we have 1 2 3 4, 5 and 6. So this is number of occupied cell. Solution is possible. Multiplied multiplied by 11. 50 multiplied by 13. 175 multiplied by 18. 25 multiplied by 13. 25 multiplied by 10. 125 multiplied by 10. 